here we go right in front of the library and we're on second street which is such a cute walkable place for dining shopping um, lots of fun activities for your guests to do and this should be the proper right here to my left oh my god i'm so sorry i have not used this camera in so long this dang phone oh i think i'm recording oh my god let's go um we can go in oh, yeah okay. no i'm just uh gonna record on here this is goldie's oh it is small this is so beautiful um what we're saying for this space, I would say this is like, uh, maybe like 800 square feet. This is a pretty small space. Um, 25 if, people is the max capacity. In and is that like non-COVID times? No, in regular. Uh, in regular times, 25 people max. Um, we were, Brenda and I at uh, Proper were talking that if you want to have drinks afterwards, it would just be with a couple of extra people and they have to be guests only and you do have to have a reservation to come in here. So this is the restaurant and bar. Very important to note, again, it's very intimate. So it's not anything we're encouraging for you guys for after party drinks. Um, this is the restaurant. Again, all the furniture is super curated and cute but this would be more so if your guests are wanting to grab a bite to eat not anything necessarily reserved or um, for any official part of the weekend so from here from here to the top of the stairs is all private event space that's okay. available you would have this exclusively um, it's beautiful like 60 over 60 area rugs that have been patched work together to create this beautiful runner uh-huh uh, Do you have security way. at the bottom? Yes. Okay. And just our team also. Yeah. Um, and then from here on up, we you would really have the space. So some of our runnings have staged maybe a guitarist here. Cute. Or, some um, welcome signage right on this landing. And then just the amount of detail that goes up. It's such a beautiful entrance with the ceiling and the overall. Yes, the definitely a lot of detail. It's beautiful. There is an elevator, of course, should you have anyone who can't do the yeah. stairs. <laughs> Not a breath. Okay, I will. And then this opens up to the for yourself. Cocktail hour? This or brisk? Cocktail hour. I'll show you where we're looking at. Outside. Beautiful. Plenty of room. And you have direct access to an outdoor balcony. And you'll have the direct access to the balcony also from the, I can raise the shears. Oh no, you're fine. So if we um, want this for cocktail hour as well. You'll have it in, with direct access to the balcony too. We set it. So we're looking, we're inside the ballroom now. We're thinking ceremony in front of these windows. And then I just want to get details of the ceiling for you. It looks awesome. Carpet, I would say, is black and beige. Would I be right? I don't know. Um, there's an air wall here. So what we would do is ceremony on this side. You could come in these doors right here, uh, walk down here, and then down an aisle this way. And then there's your backdrop. We can put a nice arch right there. But there's plenty, plenty of room in here. Everyone would go outside for cocktail hour and we would change the space up to be uh, dinner afterwards. All right, so we're on the other side of the ballroom. This is where we would stage all the dining tables and uh, chairs and centerpieces. This wall will come down where we were was on the other side of the wall and we'll just pull everything over. But I wanted to show you the in-house chair and you know we can always bring in chairs if it doesn't fit your aesthetic. There are no linens in the hotel either so we'll have to bring those in which is totally fine. Easy peasy. And the tables are over here, custom yeah. built Italian tables. Are they 72? No, they're actually 70s. I know 70s, okay. 70s. That, that's totally fine. Because they are custom made, so they're yeah. a little bit different. We would just still get a 132. Mm -hmm. not, we wouldn't yeah. need a custom uh, linen. I guess my question is, what color is your um, dance floor? So our dance floor is going to be the same color as the tables, so it matches. 
um, the overall? It's like a beige. dark brown grayish. Looks more brown in that thing. I'm gonna go. It's a dark brown. Dark brown. Okay, which is nice. It's not like a, it's not like that teak kind of dance floor you see where it almost looks more like those chairs. This is much darker, much nicer, and more it elegant. The overall feel of the yes. Um, I'm just gonna give you the ceiling again. It's really pretty. All right, just showing you this because these are super nice clay or ceramic stoneware. Um, you know, you really don't see this a lot in hotels. What color is the flatware? It's a darker, um, darker color. If we get a gray linen, like a, almost a darker gray linen to go with like black, white, and gray, this would look really cool on it, I think. Just showing you the entire room now because it could be used for where we stage Bailey and his groomsmen before the ceremony. And then there's like a little bar there, back even for that. 